I can't believe this. The school year begins in just a few days for some districts and custodians are hard at work preparing for staff and students arrival. We thank you for staying with us at 530. I'm Vanessa Rufus. We can tell you districts in both South and North Carolina continue to see growth. They are adding new schools and those additions highlight the need for more custodians to help clean those schools. WCNC Charlotte's Shamaria Morrison spoke with local districts about this growing problem to hire. With a district the size of Charlotte Mecklenburg, every custodian matters. They're already slated to actually open two new schools this year. There are more slated for the upcoming school year. So with every new school that opens, well, they need more custodians. Miss Renee leads the custodian team here at Oakhurst Steam Academy. It's a job that means more than cleaning to her. You don't know if some of the kids have clean environments or not. But you want to make sure you're, when they come in this building, I want to make sure they're in a clean environment. Hours of work and weeks of prep are behind getting CMS schools clean and ready for students to come back. And they need more people. Right now, it's a need of about 23 custodians district-wide. Oakhurst STEAM is one of those schools in need. Miss Renee is only looking for one thing in a candidate. Be able to do the job. No slacker, just keep going. And as districts in our area continue to see growth, so does the pressure to have more custodians to keep those schools clean. We're growing, you know, exponentially here in York, and I think that is because of, you know, those outer area cities and people starting to want to kind of get out of the city area and come more to a rural area. York School District 1 is closing in on the last few hirings it needs for custodian spots. Custodians are more than just people that are cleaning our buildings. They're a part of our staff. Our students look to them as role models too, just like they do our teachers. And as that district continues to expand, they will have to compete more aggressively with larger districts. They're looking for dedicated people. Some of our buildings are over 20 years old and you walk in them and they look brand new. It is because of the work of our custodians. The custodian job is one that requires hard work and a certain skill set with students at the center. I love them to death. Some of them are so sweet. Those students will come back in a few weeks to a building cleaned with love. CMS does have a hiring fair next Thursday. They're looking for custodians, also looking for bus drivers. Live in East Charlotte, Shamaria Morrison, WCNC Charlotte.